speed run! Wait, wait, hold on a second, I can figure out where we're oh. going. Okay, well, we're gonna maybe do a speed run after we figure out where we're going. Okay, welcome back to another episode of the Night Ranger! We're gonna speed run! I'm gonna go and try and do some shines real quick. Okay, you're, you're getting timed! I am being timed! We're in 19 ish seconds. Scrubbing oh, screen that, that was three seconds this one, ago. This one's actually neat because you have to be quick with this one. It's like, oh, can you get rid of all the slime in any amount of time? Oh, you know I can get rid of the Kinda slime. Kind like of like blowing up the garbage in Mario Galaxy. Yes, that one I've never actually been able to do. So I just gave up. I'm a quitter. You're going to hear the controller just doing the. Alright, here we go. We're just cleaning up. We're cleaning up. This is how oh, I... Oh wow, he gives you three minutes to do this. Yeah, there's tons of time. Yeah, I was gonna say, you're Because people mostly... Dude. People will mostly go through it like this. Oh yeah, that's stupid. But I just do this. Yeah, that's way better. Do you have to get every little spot? Uh, not really. You just gotta get most of it. It's like percentage... It's like Splatoon, basically. Uh, yeah, have you been playing that at all, maybe? Uh, no, because I got a PS4. Oh, that's right. And I have been playing Battlefront, Battlefront. like 24 7. You want to do some Battlefront tomorrow? Uh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. So, oh yeah. So, um, I was using the barrage, but that was fun. But, anyways, I really like the, the, um, the, I think it's the Frank Black Bomb or something. It's basically, uh, as soon as it hits the ground, oh, the impact, the impact, impact grenade. Impact yes. Grenade. I like that one more. Really? Yes. I like it more than all of them. So that I'm using that now, plus the jetpack. Hmm. And the scan pulse as usual. Really? Yeah, for those of you who don't know, I'm talking about Battlefront. Star Wars Battlefront. It's for the uh, all the consoles, mostly. Um, where the heck is that last bit? Where is it? Oh, it's over here. I missed the spot. <laughs> you, don't you hate that one? Sounds like, you missed the spot! <laughs> I don't think anybody's ever said that to me. Well, you're lucky. Oh, I did it. You done it. Where is he? <laughs> you done it. Oh, speaking of you done it, yeah. uh, we got some more Mario Maker levels, and we're gonna play them. And one of them is called You Done It, which I was very pleased with. Who named it that? Uh, Sleepy Guy. Does he know that story? Yes. That's why he named it. We that? said we said we told that story while we played one of his levels like months and months ago. Really? Yeah. So he. Oh, I like that. So we made we told that story on his level. So he made another, another oh, level and called it. You done it. He's so much better than Moon Coon. <laughs> 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 yeah, stupid Moon Coon. He's so much better. Uh, Moon. Well, Moon Coon. He's a swell guy. He is really nice. Uh, he's just very trolly. No. And and oh, he knows what um. he knows what annoys me. Is <laughs> he would comment just like you went through the door. I can't believe I you saw went that. The door. And I'm like I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> oh. I didn't think the door was gonna be bad. I I was like 90 percent sure. But then why did you listen to me? Just rub some vinegar on there, stupid. Because you're my best friend, Kay, and I trust you. Even though you're usually wrong, I'm just kidding. I am usually almost always wrong. No, don't say that. Usually almost always? Usually almost always, maybe kind of, sort of. Sometimes? Mm, perhaps. Yeah, that's probably it. Just be as vague as possible. So, in case you're wondering what that sound is, that's just Sammy rummaging through. Oh my <laughs> I don't know why we keep her around. <laughs> so anyways. You oh, have a I, spaceman I, helmet. Larry's spaceman, sorry. It's just like a reflex at this point. <laughs> I do it too. Larry's spaceman. That's just saying. Soyvus. Oh yeah, you can say Soyvus. Soyvus. Larry's spaceman, it's Soyvus. Alright, cool. So now we just go down in here. Wait, I don't even have to go all the way up here. I could have just went down. I forgot. You just died. No. No? No. We're down here. We're, uh, we're a dentist. We're going to be helping this poor little eel Ooh. with his disgusting teeth. So, I don't know if this can be done. What? But I thought it might be fun when I do get my Atari power cable Yeah. to do an episode of a bunch of random Atari games because I don't know half of my Atari games. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, classic games are fun because a lot of them, they were made before, like, people knew how to develop games properly. So some of them are pretty terrible, there's but some only, of them are good. There's only a couple of the ones that I have that I actually know. Yeah. And I'm really excited to see the rest of them. Ooh, yeah. Ow. So you get a spray here. He's got some nasty halitosis. Get, what is halitosis again? Bad I breath. Know. 
Oh, really? Yep. That's what it is. That's all it is. Oof, I got some halitosis. Oh, man, me I too. Get, I get bad breath all the time. I really don't like it. It makes, you know, me, it makes me so self-conscious yeah. about everything. You know, what, uh, you know what my biggest problem with bad breath is? Is if I don't eat something. Oh, if, really? I'm, if I'm hungry, oh. that's when I get terrible bad breath. I can see that. Me, I, I don't know. Even when I brush my teeth, I still, it's not that nice. Although, it might just be me being insecure, honestly. Okay, hold on. Man, so we talk about some real stuff sometimes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, the, like the whole regular. being afraid of stuff. and this then like a regular old episode of Dr. Phil. <laughs> don't even get me started on Dr. Phil. <laughs> so, okay. Uh -huh. I've watched a lot of Dr. Phil. Okay. And I'm, I'm not proud of that. But Why? the thing is, it's just, well, I, it's stupid. It's like the Mari show, but dumber, and he's not even a doctor, and it's just like, the most He has a doctorate. Whatever. <laughs> doctors. So does Marilyn Manson. Okay. So anyways, um. It's Dr. Marilyn Manson to you. It's Dr. Manson to you. Um. <laughs> I have a PhD. But the thing is, is I, I didn't really ever... Okay, so there was a big period in like when I was in high school where I didn't have cable or TV or internet or nothing. Yeah. I don't know how I lived, honestly. But uh, we had rabbit ear antennas. Yeah. And we got like two channels. And like whenever I came home, Dr. Phil would be on. <laughs> and it was the only thing that was... Okay, everything else was in French. So people who live in, the, in, in America, I forget that not everything is bilingual there. Like, every kind of packaging of food has a French side on it, and that's just so normal to me, but I, I was I was, I was was getting messages from people that are like, oh, bagged milk. I'm like, that's a normal thing. And, and... Wait, they don't have bagged milk? No! What? Americans don't have bags of milk. Wow. I know, right? And they don't have, like, like I understand why they don't have French on everything. It's because oh, I'm being eaten. eaten. Did I just seriously get eaten? Oh, no, he just spit me. That's scary. I've never actually had that happen before. I can understand the whole French, no French packaging, yeah. but I think it'd be really weird to see. But anyways, the weird thing is, is people think, oh, Canada is a bilingual country. Our prime minister knows French and English. It's really not that bilingual. No. Everyone speaks English. And Some people speak French. To be fair, I think the only actual official bilingual province is us, New Brunswick. Yeah. And not everyone speaks French. I sure don't know French. I can... you, want, you want to know something? I know less French than most people in this province. You want to know why? Because you don't know it? Because I shouldn't have passed my French exam. Uh, Do you remember that story? Maybe? Okay, so our, you need to go to French class for like at least, I think it was like at least two, you needed at least two French credits to graduate. Okay. And I was like, I'm only doing these two classes to graduate because I don't... I can't get my head around languages, and if I'm gonna learn a language, I, no offense, but I don't really want to learn French. I'd rather learn like my own cultures, yeah. uh, language and stuff, or, or or something, you know. Uh huh. But anyway, so our exam was you needed to write a like one page essay in uh, in French <laughs> and use the grammar and everything and whatever. You had like like a, a, like a day, to, like two like two days or whatever. You had some time to do it. Anyway, I had I had a French friend. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, anyway, oh, I oh actually, story. okay. Actually, there's a there's a YouTuber. His name is Guitar Did something something or rather. I'll leave a link in the description below. Go find it. He makes really awesome guitar videos. Um, anyway, it's his. It was his girlfriend at the time. His now wife. Um, she speaks French. I wrote a quick little essay, and I was like, Hey, Giselle, do you want to? Um, can you do me a favor? She's like, what? And she was like, she she was like, good. She didn't want to, but I was like, here, I'll I'll I'll, I'll give you whatever money I have, and I'll I don't know, I'll get you some food or something like that. And just do it. And she's like, I don't want to get caught. I'm like, you won't get caught. I'm gonna write it in my own writing. So she wrote it in French, proper grammar, and I'm like throwing a couple of mistakes just to make it <laughs> not too good. And so she did. She put in a couple of mistakes. Nice. And I wrote it back down in my own writing. Passed the exam. Never had to take French. I don't even know what it nice. said. So I know less French than most people in this province because most people graduated legitimately. I paid to get through my shop class. Really? Yeah. I remember uh, during the exam in my shop class, uh, my I, I had a pencil, a wooden pencil, and it wasn't sharp. 
So we didn't have a sharpener. I didn't have a sharpener. The teacher didn't have a sharpener. So I went over, put some goggles on, <laughs> went over to the belt sander, <laughs> and I wrapped it up and just sharpened nice. my pencil on the belt sander. Yeah, I, uh, I, you know, the funny thing is, like, I can do. Hey, goodbye. Oh.